Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So we recently did our Q&A video and some of you guys commented on the video with some more questions so I thought that I'd jump right in and just answer them for you on this video. So popping through our questions that we had, we had a question from Chloe. Hi Chloe. So Chloe asks how often do you go to Weymouth Bay? So um, when it comes to the holiday parks we only go to the same park two or three times a year. This is so that um, the people who go to the parks and watch the acts get a different variety, they don't see the same act every time. So we only go to Weymouth Bay three times maximum a year and they're usually quite spread out through the year. So that's how often we go to Weymouth Bay, so thank you for that question. We also had a couple more questions, let me just have a look. So. Um, this question is from Callum and Callum says, I would like to know how you found find out about your gigs. Do you know weeks in advance or do you find out week to week? And also how far would you travel to a gig? So we generally get our holiday park bookings through anywhere from November to January. Um, they come through in bulk and we sign our contracts for them. Um, and they are for the upcoming year, so we know well in advance what gigs we're doing. Um, we have them all planned out for the year in advance, so it's not week to week or anything like that. Um, so in terms of travel for a gig, it depends if we do a holiday park, it depends if we do a wedding. If we do a wedding, we can pretty much travel to anywhere, or a private party, we travel to anywhere, as long as the travel costs are covered. Um, so we've been as far as North Wales, we've been as far as Brighton, um, holiday parks, we tend to book just for the west and south coast, so um, the furthest we've been for holiday park is like Tenby in Wales, so it's about a three and a half hour drive from us west, um, we do Torquay. We go as far east as Kent, um, but that's about it. We, obviously there are holiday parks all throughout the UK. We don't tend to go up north very often. Um, we've never done Scotland. Um, in terms of the holiday parks, our agent who we use groups our holiday parks. So we tend to get one weekend where there are two parks close together so that it limits the travel between the two so um it's not too bad it's usually only like an hour maximum between each park on the friday and the saturday so that's kind of how we go with our gigs let me just check there are no more questions no so that's all the questions i think that we had um i thought i would give you guys another update so we've had two weeks off um we have had a few changes in the last few weeks i'm going to be completely open and honest with you and say that we have had to let go of our bassist Tom. So you guys would have seen Ginger Tom in our videos. He's been in the band for the last two years and I'm not going to get into why we got rid of him or anything like that because I do not want to shame people and I just don't think it's right to go into it. Um, but we did get rid of him. Uh, we are looking for a permanent bassist to join us, so if any of you guys can play bass to a high standard and you think you might want to join us, please let us know, send us a message. Um, we'd love to use you for a debt gig or as a permanent member possibly, so we are looking for people. Um, so you guys might see some random bass players in some of our upcoming vlogs. We are going to be using deck players um, until we find a permanent bass player to fill the position of Tom. So just wanted to be completely transparent with you is that's kind of what has happened the last few weeks. And that's kind of why our videos have been a bit like we did the last question and answer without Tom as well. So, ah, Neil's just come back from his run. Hi Neil, I'm doing a vlog. Hello. Neil's just been running, so guys, as you know, Neil, um, Neil's hobby is running, and Neil is doing an ultra marathon this weekend. A baby one. A baby one. He says baby one. It's thirty miles, and it has three thousand foot of incline. So, last run before then, Neil, how was it today? Uh, terrible. Terrible. Oh it's dear. It's going to be terrible. Um, I need to 
his mind to get his shoes. Yeah, he needs to sort his running shoes out. Anyway, so yeah, that's uh, really kind of just a little update for you. Um, me and Neil went away this week. We went up to Snowdon and we climbed Snowdon twice in two days. So we're a little bit achy, but that was good fun. It was nice to have a break just for a little bit. But we've got a really busy September coming up. So you guys will see quite a few vlogs from us. So yeah, anyway, let us know if you do have any more questions. I'm more than happy to keep doing these kind of vlogs. So yeah, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.